Welcome to the online video series presented by Structure Studios. This video will explain 360 photos and videos. Exclusively with VIP 3D, you can create interactive 360 photos and videos to share with your clients and interact with either the mouse on the PC or smartphone or tablet. We'll access the Create Presentation stage. We'll start by creating a 360 degree photo, so we'll click on the Photo Mode button. We can adjust the 3D view to get the perfect angle or use an existing camera location we've already saved. All existing locations and new locations can be used to create both standard and 360 photos. Once we have the angle we like, we're ready to create our 360 photo. Simply toggle the 360 photo button on and click on Take Photo or press P. That's it. Even though we're facing a single direction when taking our photo, we'll be able to look in 360 degrees around the camera location. We'll view our 360 photo after we record our video. Please note that artistic image effects and text effects, like those we see here, will not be visible in 360 photos and videos. Turning on 360 mode will temporarily disable these features, but they'll immediately return once 360 mode is turned off. Now we'll take our 360 video, so we'll click on the Video Mode button. Just as with photos, we can create new locations or simply turn on 360 mode and choose to render our existing storyboard as a 360 video. Please note that 360 videos will take significantly longer to render than standard videos, as the video is being recorded in all directions at once instead of just one. The faster your computer's processor is, the faster the video can render. To learn more about photo mode and video mode, make sure to watch the corresponding help videos for each of these features. 360 photos and videos can be found with standard photos and videos in the current project folder and in the media viewer as well. They are named with a 360 in the title so we can easily identify them. 360 videos are best viewed on YouTube, Facebook, or Vimeo, while 360 photos work best on Facebook. We'll select our 360 photos and upload them to Facebook, and once that's complete, we'll also upload our video to YouTube. Viewing 360 photos and videos on the PC will make them appear stretched out, so it's best to upload them for the perfect appearance. Now that our content is online, let's view it first with our PC's browser. On Facebook, we can see our 360 photos. As we left-click and drag the mouse, we can change our view. Even though we took the photo facing only one direction, we can look in any direction with the mouse. We can even share it directly with our client on Facebook. Soon, we'll try it on a mobile device, but first, let's check out our video on YouTube. Our video works just like our photo, so we can left-click and drag to look in any direction. We can pause the video at any time and continue to adjust the view. Create a walkthrough of the project and your client can rewind or fast-forward, pausing at their favorite features and adjusting the view with the mouse. Now we'll try it on our mobile devices for an even bigger wow factor. As we move the device around, the view automatically changes. Your client's smartphone or tablet is now a window into their future project. You can even use devices like Google VR, Google Cardboard, or Google Daydream to view in virtual reality. The view will change as your client moves their head using these devices. Thanks for watching! Please let us know if you have any questions by calling 800-778-8996 or emailing support at structurestudios.com.